Hi guys, this is Teacher Nim. Today, pag-aaralan natin kung ano ba ang ibig sabihin ng expression at equation at kung ano ang kanilang pinagkaiba. Alright, uh, ngayon pag-aralan natin ano ba ang ibig sabihin ng expression at equation at ang kanilang pinagkaiba. Kapag sinabi natin na expression, ito ay isang number, variable, or a combination of numbers and variables, and operation symbols. Also, it is simplified through evaluation where we substitute values in place of variables. Always remember that in an expression, there is no symbol relation. While an equation is made up of two expressions and connected by an equal sign. An equation is two-sided where an equal sign separates the left and the right sides. Para mas lalo ninyong maintindihan, mayroon ako mga inihandang example dito. I have here example of expression. Sabi natin kanina, ang expression ay isang number, variable, o kaya naman ay combination ng numbers and variables, and operation symbols. We're talking here of the mathematical operation, yung operation symbols dito. Let's have example number 1. 5 plus 28. Yung 5 and 28 dyan, yan ay ang number. And obviously, yung plus sign sa gitna ay ang ating mathematical operation symbol. Therefore, itong 5 plus 28 ay isang halimbawa ng expression. Let's have another. x minus 1. Yung x naman dito ay ang variable. At yung 1 ay ang number. At yung minus sign sa gitna ay ang operation symbol. Therefore, itong x minus 1 ay isang example pa rin ng expression. Next, let's have 2x. Yung 2 dito ay ang number at yung x ay ang variable. Therefore, itong 2x na to ay isang example din ng expression. Sabi natin kanina, an expression is simplified through evaluation where we substitute values in place of variables. Let's have an example. If the value of x is equal to 2, let us evaluate x plus 3. Paano ba tayo nag -e evaluate ng expression? x plus 3. Yung value ng x dito ay given na, which is equal to 2. Ang gagawin lang natin dyan is we are going to substitute the value of x na 2 dito sa x plus 3. So that would be 2 plus 3. And 2 plus 3 is equal to 5. Okay, let's have another example. If the value of x is equal to 4, evaluate natin itong 2x. Kapag ganito na magkatabi yung number at variable at walang operation na nagsiseparate sa kanilang dalawa, ang ibig sabihin nun ay we are going to multiply. 2 times x or 2x. We are going to substitute the value of x here na 4. So that would be 2 times 4. 2 times 4 is equal to 8. Okay, now let's proceed to the examples of equation. Kanina sabi natin ang isang equation ay made up of two expressions and connected by an equal sign. It is two-sided where an equal sign separates the left and the right sides. Napaliwanag ko na sa inyo kanina kung anong ibig sabihin ng expressions. Now, magbigay tayo ng example ng equation. 2 plus 3 is equal to 8 minus 3. Yung 2 plus 3 dito ay ang expression. 8 minus 3 ay isa pa rin expression. At sila ay pinagkoconnect ng equal sign. Sabi dito, ang isang equation ay made up of two expressions. So, nasan ba dyan yung two expressions? Una is yung 2 plus 3 at yung pangalawa ay yung 8 minus 3. Ano ba nagkoconnect sa kanilang dalawa? 
yung equal sign sa gitna. Ibig sabihin yan, yung left and right daw must be equal. Yan ang patutunayan natin ngayon. We have 2 plus 3 is equal to 8 minus 3. Unahin muna natin isolve yung 2 plus 3. And that is equal to 5. Kopyahin lang natin yung 8 minus 3. And then 5 is equal to 8 minus 3 is equal to 5. 5 is equal to 5. Therefore, this equation is correct. Next. If the value of n is equal to 10, i-evaluate naman natin itong n plus 5 is equal to 27 minus 12. Una, i-substitute natin yung value ng n dun sa n plus 5. Yun yung unang expression. So that would be 10 plus 5 is equal to 27 minus 12. At saka natin ngayon, i-add yung 10 plus 5, and that is 15, is equal to 27 minus 12. Solve na natin yung 27 minus 12. 15 is equal to 15. Alright, basta lagi niyong tatandaan na kapag sinabi niya equation, eto yung nagpapakita ng equality dun sa statement ng dalawang expressions. Now I have here exercises. I want you to write EX if the statement is an expression and EQ if the statement is an equation. Kung natuto, like naman ang video na to and please subscribe to my channel. Click the notification bell para updated ka sa lahat ng tutorial videos ko. Thank you and stay healthy!